Thorns are gearing up for their semifinal match against San Diego on Sunday. They have prepped for this match in the wake of the investigation involving Merritt Paulson and club executives for mishandling alleged sexual misconduct. And the Thorns have yet to comment on the investigation, but they did have a message for fans today. Fox 12's Polina Aguilar has more on what they had to say. We've been following the story since the beginning, and the Thorns want to make two things clear. One, all they want to do is play, and two, they need the fans now more than ever. Coach Wilkinson says her and her staff have done what they can to create a safe environment, giving the team the space and support they need. She says she doesn't like that her players are frequently being asked questions that are not in the spirit of influence, and people don't recognize it can take an emotional toll. And we expected statements and we expected teams to come out. And right now, half of them don't know what to think because they can't really share an opinion because they're going to tick off someone or annoy someone out. They're just trying to be quiet and just get back to playing. She also says her team is not in a place to express any comments. People have a microphone in their face and they're demanding answers. They're demanding strong opinion. And, Journalist's job is to ask questions, to ask hard questions, to, to make sure all the answers are there. But my athletes, their job is to play, and they're, and they're not sure. They don't know. Some of the, Again, some of them are sure. They, they're very clear on where they stand on many, many topics, but some of them aren't, and they can't say that. This is not an environment where every, anyone can go against the current, um, and it's not a conversation right now. Forward Christine Sinclair, who has been with Portland for nearly 10 years, was asked if Merritt Paulson should sell the team. It's been an interesting couple weeks, obviously, but, uh, but at the same time, unfortunately, we went through this exact same thing about this time last year. So for a lot of us, there's nothing new, you know, and so we've really tried to, to focus on us. Fans have expressed they don't know how to move forward and support the players for Sunday's game. But players like goalkeeper Bella Bigsby are asking to put the issues of the front office aside. I don't, I don't question the, the support we're going to get. Um, the fans here are tremendous. Um, obviously, they're vocal and <laughs> have their wishes and, you know, have their opinions, which is perfectly fine. But deep down, we know that they support the players and they're here for us. Wilkinson gave thanks to fans who are still by their side, as well as the sponsors. That is completely understandable. These players deserve the fan support. They've earned it through the season. They love the fans. There's a crazy connection there that it's amazing to watch. And take the front office and put it aside. The Thorns are set to play San Diego Wave Sunday at 2 p.m. And they say they're expecting a full stadium. Reporting from Providence Park, Pauline Aguilar, Fox 12, Oregon.